What is up, y'all? It's your boy Zo, and we back with another fire ass video, man. And as y'all can tell from this title, bruh, don't do this at the range, all right? I learned, learn from me, I learned. Don't do this at the range. But anyway, for today's video, I got my boy locked in, loaded with me. We head into the gun range over at Bill's to shoot our Glock 45s and my AR-15 that I bought probably like two months ago that I haven't got to shoot. So that's what we forgot to do today. But without further ado, let's jump right into this video. All right, so I'm gonna shoot the AR, but really quick, let me show y'all something really quick that I got going on with it. There she goes, all beautiful like. We got the tactical light on there. We got the 60 round mag. We got the two 40 round mags right here, banana clips. But what I wanna talk to y'all about is, y'all see this? That's that Romeo 5 joint on there for y'all. But I don't got a sighted in. My boy Locked and Lotus said he was gonna get it sighted in for me. But we're gonna go ahead and shoot this thing anyway. All right, so let's go ahead and shoot this AR. Like I said, don't attack me in the comment section, okay? I haven't shot this yet, okay? It's not even sighted in, so just give me a break, all right? All right, y'all, so y'all know how I said my AR wasn't sighted in? Well, here's the target. And that's what I shot. Shot the damn string, y'all. I couldn't hit the target, but I hit the string. That's how uninsighted my AR was. So if y'all needed a lesson in what not to do at the gun range, that's not what to do. Don't bring your non-sighted in AR and think you can go ahead and shoot it at a target that's 15 yards away, because that's not gonna happen, all right? Just, well, at least for me, it didn't happen. So I guess lesson one-on-one right there, boys. Damn, damn, I feel ugly for that. <laughs> Did you tell them yet? Not yet, no. I know what y'all thinking. I know, I know, I know. I hear it, I'm a mind reader, all right? So don't even go down in the comment section and start typing, okay? And no, I'm not talking about how I got the damn apple from the sunflower seeds. I'm talking about the AR shot I just did, man. I know, I know. Hear me out, all right? I'm not using this as an excuse, but I'm going to, all right? I got my CCW back in November. So that makes me a fairly new shooter, okay? Hear me out. Like I told y'all earlier, my sights was not sighted in, okay? Hear me out, hear me out. So in my mind, my logic is, okay, if it's not sighted in, I'm not gonna look down the sights, all right? I'm gonna just hold the AR down range and hope I hit it a couple of times, you know what I mean? Didn't think anything about it, but as I start shooting it, you guys can go back and see, you can look at my eyes, I'm trying to find the target and not realizing that I'm lifting the barrel of the gun up a little bit to the left. And as y'all just saw, I hit the line, all right? There you go, I hit the line, I messed up, I'm sorry, all right? Like I said, I'm a new shooter, all right? Cut me some slack, cut me some slack, all right? Anyway, back to the video. All right, so let's just forget what I just go ahead and get some work in with my support hand real quick and see how accurate I can get with it definitely is where bro I don't know if y'all can if y'all can see the camera but my hands shaking and shit it's just weird holding it, shooting it with my especially if you haven't done it before so now I'm gonna get some rounds in with the beretta Next, we got the Hellcat. All 
All right, so my boy Dre, AKA Locked and Loaded, just gave me a tip real quick. And he kind of gave me the advice to go ahead and turn the gun at a 45 degree angle. It should help with my accuracy and feel a little bit better in my hand as well. Uh, real quick too, I have this is my boy Dre, aka Locked In Loaded, y'all. Uh, I mean, honestly, he's the reason why this channel is honestly blowing up. And he won't take credit for it, but he's the reason why my channel is blowing up. I just want to give a huge shout out to y'all really quick as well. Y'all showed mad love for my last video, and that means a lot to your boy. So go ahead, if you haven't already, tickle that like and that subscribe button right now. But we can go ahead and get into some more shooting. I'm gonna go ahead and do that again with my uh, support hand, but I'm gonna angle it at 45 degrees and see if that makes a little bit of a difference. Now I'm going to try it with the Beretta. So the main ones that I took with my left hand are these right here and these guys right here. These I was testing out and shooting some other stuff, but with my left or support hand, I was shooting. That's not bad honestly because right here in the yellow is where I started getting on better grouping when I angled it at 45 degrees and this is when I was holding it straight up at this one right here so you guys can kind of see the difference I got them a little bit more grouped up here on number six versus number one all right so I got like six rounds left I'm just gonna go ahead and throw it in the 45 and just dump these out real quick Okay, let's take a look at this paper. I oh, tore this paper up, y'all. I tore this paper up. So as y'all can see, I put some more rounds in this area. That's where I shot it at. That's where I've been mainly trying to shoot at ever since the Drake gave me that little advice on turning it 45 degree at angle. But yeah, like I said, don't judge me on these or up there. These are the main ones that I was shooting at one and six. Got locked and loaded prodigy here. He says it's gonna make me jealous from all the other guns, so we're gonna, we gonna find out. What you think though? I think it's smooth, low key. I, I, the handle part of it though, is chunky. Not chunky, but wide, I guess. Mm -hmm. It's just long that way. You know what I mean? But other than that, it's a smooth little thing though. Staccato though. No. <laughs> what your staccato? It ain't staccato though. It ain't staccato, it ain't staccato though, but. I'm gonna show you why this is better. All right, go ahead. Show me, show me something then. I'm gonna go do seven. See, look, I ain't do all of that. That ain't my gun to be doing all of that with. See, you know what I mean? He can go ahead and do that. I'm not just gonna pick up somebody's gun and just start blasting everything off. You know what I mean? I got some respect, but I got some respect. All right, y'all, so we just got done shooting and now we're just looking up the stairs. It's been about a week since I bought my 45, so you know, we gotta browse around a little bit, see what they stocked up on. This is all the used gun section right here. Got some more Glocks. Look at that Sig. That 5.56 five, right there. A little Draco. This man wanna buy him a high point though. Hey, look. I'm telling y'all right now. Get this video, or get this channel to 20 likes, or uh, 20 subs, which is only four away. I'm gonna buy that high point. And then I'm gonna prove to Lock and Loader over here. You want to make that bet? I'm down. You want to make that bet? One chip challenge. One chip challenge. All right, bet. Y'all see it right here. Me and Lucky Little got a challenge now. Y'all get this channel to 20 subs, which is only four away. I'm gonna buy that high point, and I'm gonna be locked and loaded in the chip challenge. All right. All right, y'all boys, that is it for this video, man. If y'all made it this far and y'all haven't already, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button for y'all boy, man. We four subscribers away from 20. As y'all just heard from that last clip, if I hit 20 subs, I'm gonna buy the high point and me and Locked and Loaded over here, we gonna get it on with the one chip challenge. Say it right, you gonna lose the challenge, you gonna eat that one chip. 
talk. All talk. That's what he is. But real quick though, too, if y'all haven't already, man, go check my boy's channel out, man. I've been saying it all video, man. It's locked and loaded, man. Get in tune. It's locked and loaded. Go check him out. I might put his name here or down in the description. All over the screen. Just hey, <laughs> I might just put it all over the screen. But okay, I might just no, put it all over the screen. Yeah. But anyway, man, like I said, man, that's it for the video, man. Like I said, go ahead and tickle that like and subscribe button for y'all, boy. And as always, stay safe and stay strapped. I'll see you at the next video. Peace.